in this video I'm gonna show you guys how to lower the temp of your laptop so let's go first let's check the surface temperature of our laptop so as you can see it's quite high uh, maybe it will fall and yeah 41.4 it's quite high to mention I purchased a notebook cooler or laptop cooler and the specification is 15.6 a high speed fan, high performance, and a double USB port. So let's unbox this one. As I mentioned before, we have five fan. Actually, the center fan serves as an exhaust, and the remaining four fan is the cooler fan. So we also have two USB port. We also have the USB cable that is included in the box and we're gonna use it to power the laptop cooler. Oh by the way guys before I forgot, there is a one functionality of this laptop cooler that I like. It is the reclining functionality. So you can recline it in a low medium and high reclining position there is also a display panel on it and you can see the speed of your fan and there is a three button that you can increase, decrease, and uh, you can turn off and on your laptop core. I forgot the maximum speed is six and the minimum or the lowest speed is one. Mention guys, it also had a LED light. So in my case, I have the blue color. So I think you have to choose from red, green, and blue. Beside purchasing the laptop cooler, I plan to clean the internal fan of the laptop. So the tools that I have to use is the screwdriver. And some of you wondering when I, why I have gloves here. So if you don't have a static band, uh, you can use your gloves. So basically, if you will open any electronic devices, you have to discharge or you have to uh, not to uh, pass on the static in the electronic or in the ICs what inside the laptop so let's start There you go, we opened the laptop and forgot to mention we need a brush. We can use any kind of brush as long as it's a soft bristle. For me, I have to borrow one of the makeup brush of my wife and I think she will not allow me to return it back. She will just throw this one. And we have to purchase also a different kind of torque screw, I think. Uh, because I see uh, in the battery screw, we should have a star-shaped torque screw. Uh, there you go. We have two 
take it off the battery then and now we can take out also the fan one by one this is the one I mentioned before so we have to look for a torch screwdriver that uh, could fit in in this cruise so that we can uh, detach the fan smoothly There you go, all the screws from the first fan was uh, take out. So all you have to do is to pull up the pin from the motherboard. Just to remind you guys, uh, for we to able to uh, remove the connector pin of the fan from the motherboard, we should uh, pull it upward. Okay, not inside word, but upward motion. Time to clean up the fan, so that does actually guys uh, contribute the slowing of the fan. We should also clean the exhaust vent here guys so as you can see there is a dust accumulation from the exhaust vent uh, actually that dust will impede the hot air from going out So we're done cleaning, so after cleaning up, we should uh, reattach the fan. So the pin of the fan should be attached by pushing down on the port, the pin port of the fan. After reattaching the fan, so all we have to do is uh, reattach the battery as well.
Yes, we are finished internally, so we have to reattach the back cover of the laptop. I guess we're done okay nicely smoothly done let's have a quick look my laptop cooler is running at a maximum speed of 6 then we have to look the temperature let's check all we have to do is to turn the surface mode of this thermometer Closer. There you go, guys. Let's have a quick look. It's 38. That's it. We are able to lower down our laptop temperature from 41.4 to 38. Hope you guys learn one or two in my video. So, if you have questions, suggestion, you can write down in the comment section. And guys, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share, and please subscribe.